90% of cancer, basic cancer research studies, not clinical trials, but basic cancer research studies um, that Amgen tried to replicate actually just wouldn't reproduce. They, they, they wouldn't, wouldn't uh, replicate. Um, that number is probably a bit high. That was, there was something about that data set. Uh, but if you look consistently in the life sciences, it's something between 50 and 60% of sort of, and this is preclinical science, uh, which isn't, again, clinical trials, isn't really epidemiology, but is looking at, you know, how does something work? How does this drug work in the lab? Um, maybe how does it work in animal studies, for example? Um, and so that's probably pretty consistent. In economics, there have been a couple of uh, replication sort of analyses, if you will, and one of them showed a uh, 40% replication rate. The other one showed, I think, a 60% replication rate. Mm -hmm. So not to, and those are all disparate data points, and there's lots of reasons for various things, um, but we do sort of seem to be centering and sort of settling out, if you will, around 50% of studies not being uh, reproducible, can't be replicated in, in various fields. Other fields haven't really looked at it yet.